It is now September 7th, 2009. It's a Monday after a long day at university. It's no longer college, it's university. It's wonderful. The last video I made, I was just came back from Russia. Now I'm here in my dorm room. I wanted to do a quick little um, inquiry. Tennis Craze is a... a one of the people I have been conversing with here. Tennis Craze, uh, who by the way was supposed to pass their driver license, hope that went well, uh, sent me a message about seeing me in a Dulles airport. And uh, after that, uh, not revealing to me who they were, where they saw me, and what they were doing at the time, and it's kind of creepy. So please, uh, please tell me where where you were at the time just just so that <laughs> just so that we're on the same page thank you I'm currently um, enjoying my classes in a very passive way they're boring they really are it's just discussion and my concentration is accounting so I had this brilliant idea that I must work for a company that I'm passionate about now, um, currently, I am very passionate about Weight Watchers. There is no more family problem excuse. There is no family around me here, and I am doing wonderfully, wonderfully. This is my tracker, which I am using constantly, and uh, I've already planned things for tomorrow. And then I'll show you for today, got a stamp. I stamp for myself for motivation. Stamp for Sunday. Um, Saturday night, I went out. So, oh. Um, oh no, Saturday was Saturday was excellent. Friday night was the was the one when I went over. And Thursday, I I went over, but they were um, extra points. So you see the minus 11s and the minus two right there, but I didn't stamp myself, um, I don't know, maybe I should because I didn't go over the extra points, and then the Wednesday and the Tuesday before that, and the Monday, I started last Monday, um, when my mother had left, she was here helping me move into my dorm, and, um, I have been doing so well, I am so proud of myself, I'm counting, I, and uh, what I did, I let everyone know in my suite that I'm on Weight Watchers, so there's nothing to hide from, and everyone is so helpful, they are so friendly and helpful, so I, I, I know that I'm going to do really well. I know a lot of people are doing the Hot for Halloween challenge. Um, I have decided not to join any challenges because I have a very bad record with challenges, joining them and then never keeping up. And right now I'm just taking it day by day. I'm not even thinking of a further date except I have a ticket, ticket, ticket for Chicago in November. And that is what I'm really looking forward to. I love Chicago. It's a wonderful city. And I am... Um, my, that's my first goal, to to be comfortable uh, relative to what I was, what I am now, um, uh, in Chicago. I haven't been to a Weight Watcher meeting here, in the in the city where my university is, but I'm I'm thinking, I'm debating whether or not to do that now. Uh, so far, I'm getting really good support from my sweet mates, and I don't have, I just don't have the money or the time to walk to the meeting. I haven't got the bus system down and I'm just uh, acclimatizing to classes. So honestly, I, I haven't been to a meeting and I don't know how much I weigh, but as far as how I feel and how I look in the mirror, this is paying off and I know it's really hard. It's I'm on my third year, I'm a junior uh, in university. I know it's gonna be hard, but I definitely, this is one of, this has been my priority now, and I'm sort of scared to say, but I am focusing more on Weight Watchers than on my studies now, and that's bad, but I'm just working to balance it off, because I know that when I do well in Weight Watchers, I have motivation for everything, whereas if I do well in school, I really don't have motivation for Weight Watchers, because I say, oh, I'm too busy with school. So that's not going to happen, and I know I'm rambling, I haven't made a video in a really long time. I have been out to parties, I have been dancing, and I haven't drank at parties, and all I ate at 
one of the parties was one for Rocher. So I'm really proud of myself. And then Friday night, I went to a Shabbat dinner, a Jewish dinner, and uh, the rabbi's wife does Weight Watchers every time she has a kid. So perfect, perfect. And she told me how much all the points were, so that's where the, the, the specific extra extra point thing you saw the minus 11 so I'm really really happy I'm proud of myself I'm really happy that I'm independent I take advantage of people with cars who who go to the grocery um grocery sh mart uh, grocery store and I buy my things and I put them in the refrigerator which I won't open because it's really empty now because I'm running low on food because everything is downstairs in the common fridge every one of my sweet mates has a, their own fridge and they've been gracious enough to let me use the common one so everyone's taking care of me in moral support and uh, they do offer me things which is good and I say no thank you but if I do want I will take and I'll write it down so if you bite it you write it and <laughs> it's so brilliant. I, I honestly, um, I, I'm gonna do it, and uh, I'm on my own, and I'm just doing it for myself. There's no one condescending looking at me. There's no, no event that I need to be skinny by. I am just taking it day by day, and I have been doing really well for over a week now. So considering how, how. Usually I go up to three days and I slack off. I'm just going strong and I pack my, I do my lunch and my dinner the night before. So there's no excuse because I'm always late for class and, and everything. So there's no excuse not to, not to eat the healthy food. All my teammates in class are really supportive of my carrots and I buy convenient things. Um, I went for baby tomatoes, but they, they're really expensive out here, so I cut up the tomatoes, but baby carrots and pita, pitas, whole wheat pitas, and bread, and we've got a toaster downstairs, so everything is just perfect, and I am just really looking forward to, to, to losing the weight and just being healthy. I signed up for unlimited gym classes. I haven't went because I, my fever, had a fever, and I'm still coughing things up, and I just haven't had time. So, but the unlimited classes have been bought, so obviously I'll be going, and I miss the yoga, and my yoga mat is just gathering dust over there. Uh, I have a few workout buddies set up, and uh, I've been taking photos of the food I cook. There's a lounge in the next, next door, and I go there and I cook peas or eggs. I made a sunny side up recently. I am taking pictures of them, but they're more for myself. I got the inspiration from Truly Jess, and uh, who is lovely, by the way. You should all go watch her. <laughs> and um, I decided for career choice, I'm because I'm losing motivation in school so easily, I um, want to... Um, career-wise, I would like to work for a company I'm passionate about, like Weight Watchers. And if I could be, if I could do accounting for Weight Watchers, my other, um, my other concentration might be marketing. I'm not sure yet. I believe it'll be accounting, though. Uh, it depends on how the school, how the classes, how the schedules fit. Marketing for Weight Watchers. Um, I just, uh, I would be very proud to to work at Weight Watchers. And um, another thing I've been doing is wearing clothes that fit me instead of sweatpants and t-shirts, which not only makes me feel better, but um, makes people take me more seriously, especially in the, in when, when I speak to my professors and when I talk to people who are in the business field as I'm doing accounting and I'm in the School of Commerce. So this has been a really long vlog. If you're still here, thank you. Talk to you soon.